match. Big swing from the left-hander, Ukraine captain Oleg Plotnitsky. Doesn't get the return ball. That one goes flat and wide to Kamil Semenyuk, who's managed to sit in very well on this left side position. Big time in this team. And now he is indispensable. That was huge to knock Kaziski on his backside thing. Kaziski nails it. Nice work. Well, Regas felt there was a gap open, flirted with the net, but made the shot. Hits it hard. Shikawa defensively gets it into the air and Kaziski is roofed by Russo and Perugia are starting to find some nice matchups in the game to serve a big shot. Hits it beautifully off Catania and away. Bentara ace and Perugia dominating the early stages of this first game. Bronze medalist with Argentina, Agustin Losa brings the heat. Not bad for a middle. Great ace from Losa. Good from Regas. Kolachi with the pass. Nice off pace from uh, Plotnitsky, but well read by Regas. Oh, Kolachi, great touch. Off the block. And still, Peruja can't put it down, but they get another swing here. Not on the money from Gianelli. And that is your classic Ishikawa. He'll Botelli puts it into play. Kolachi with a nice pass and a very smooth swing. Well, they're, they're producing points, not just in the... Ishikawa drags Poro out of system. Another nice piece of work off the block. Well, that's very much the Milano tactic this season. If it's not been there to kill them. And, and engage with the game. <laughs> oh, dear, mate. Wow, Russo putting a dent in the Milano court. Better pass. And the first opportunity to watch Augustin Loz there. Bentara then. It's another absolute fizzer. Oh, that is stunning. There, good serve, a good pass again. And it's just uh, allowing Gianelli to exploit that. He's got options available. He's pinning the blockers on the other. Tara doesn't quite get the toss right, so goes off pace. And so it would be unusual for this one not to go the distance. And Milano looked like they might have settled into their work. Russo again, flowing serve. Once more, the Milano pass is under pressure. He doesn't want to release that pipe at the moment, Gianelli's consistently going out wide. And at last, on cue, decides it's time for Plotnitsky at the moment. And that problem is the Russo serve. Losser passes tight, but Kaziski doesn't mind that. Massive, absolutely massive from Bentara, determined not to be outdone by Milano's right side, and he matches Regas. And Kaziski silences the crowd here in the Palabaton, and silences Golden, where Milano is your player. And that's it. Oh, good work. Porro next to Vitelli getting hold of Plotnitsky. And you can see how much that means. It'd be an easier rotation for Milano to side out. And Vitelli allowed to take the ball again. And uh, out of the back line on the pike. Kaziski strong. The environment. Huge ask. And Plotnitsky. Oh, he's in front court. The Brazilian. Been relatively quiet in this game. And at the moment, neither of the middle blockers really getting uh, an angle to stop the Milano hitters when and when he hits it right it defies the passers that is a beautiful piece of volleyball what a pass in comes the blocking presence of Derlich Zonta's on in backcourt as the setter but the double sub didn't pay wow well Milano as they've done so many times in the playoffs are delivering when it
One set point left for Perugia. And that's it. Cervera, disappointing. Hasn't made double figures. He was nearly in double figures right at the start of the last set. And that'll do nicely. Russo puts Milano under pressure again. Kaziski hits down the line. Riga's smooth swing, but another nice pass. Gianelli has had the ball on his head a lot in this match, and it means that four attackers, all in a similar tempo, are available. On his maximum spike reach over that Poro block. That's nicely done and very well picked up by Perugia. Kalachi dumps it over. That's great. That's great work. And Poro still back. That's a good hit. That's a really superb serve from Semenyuk and very deliberately targeting Ishikawa. It's probably... And it's not a figment of the imagination, surely. Good touch. Oh, that's great work from Milano and Kaziski does just enough. Just the five points in the game for him so far and he's given that one a massive crack and that really caught the passers out he has thumped that whipped into play once more by Russo and then attempts the defense but nothing doing and Milano are in business in set three side and to score they have to hit it right on the line it's hard to do that all the time fabulous well, that's starting to move to what a lot of people refer to as a bick out of the back line. But we just see off the first challenge. Great pass from Catania. What a feed from Poro again. Oh, it puts it into play. Catania gets the ball airborne. Ishikawa can't put it down. Perugia to go level. High ball. Semenya taps it over the top of the block. Regas, brilliant defence. But Perugia can go again. And the block is phenomenal. Which you don't get to experience on television. As much as we can show the action, it's not the same as being there. Three of them there in as a group. What they've developed over the course of the season. Uh, how people understand their roles. Now I mentioned Ishikawa. She can potentially come in for his... Polish compatriot, and we might be seeing that change sooner rather than later, Liam. Into the action, so the captain's on court and gets a feed immediately. <laughs> oh, dear me. I mean, seriously, Liam, I'd like to go all technical on that, but I'm going to go with holy cow. Sebastian Sole, another Olympic bronze medalist, along with the man who's just beaten him, Augustine Loser. Kaziski's still on the court, not targeted on that occasion. And kept alive somehow by Sole. That was nimble and brilliant. Perugia inventing some points here. Sole doing his best Leo Messi impersonation. <laughs> a little bit too much pause on his previous reception. Lovely flow. What a beautiful flow from that attack. The pass are immediately into motion. Kaziski and then, the, uh, sorry, Poro. Off pace serve. Fairly good pass and Leon, nothing he could do really. He's, he's got a window that he likes to run into, Leon, and if the ball's not there. Oh, wow. Cometh the hour, cometh the superstar, Leon. Uh, until now, they could have focused their block on one half of the court. Now the front row is definitely more spread. Megarejo is in again. Super. Beautiful set to Bentara, but enough time for the blockers to set themselves. And Megarejo and Kaziski back in for Megarejo. Goes off pace on the serve. Easy pass for Leon off the net. And Bentara finds the most exquisite of angles inside the block of Ishikawa. With the serve. And hammers it. 
down the line for the ace. And Perugia close it out by three sets to one and claim the advantage early in this semi-final.